Okay, today we are going to learn on how to plot the RMS. I will show how to plot RMS for the full cycle and then for the half cycle. And then I tell you why half cycle is more uh, preferable. Okay, as you already know, okay, RMS. Okay, it, that means root mean square to do the uh, rms analysis you first you must do the square and then you mean and then you root okay so that's what we do so first we take the voltage and then we get the square of the voltage okay to do this you just take this voltage and then you times by itself or you can just use square here okay and then as we learned before double click at the cross sign okay and then you mean okay to do this first i'll show you how to do the full mean okay as we already decide on the other day is one cycle have 100 points so you can do three types of moving average okay for mean we using mean average you either put the mean here okay at the start of the cycle or you put at the hundred which is here okay or there at 99 because we start at zero or you can do it at uh, 49 or 50 okay I'll choose to you to do it here okay so we take average of the from 99 99 here up to zero okay and then that's our formula okay and then you enter so now you already have the square and then just double click okay so it's copied towards the end okay so what about the the first uh 50 okay we will choose not to plot that okay so after you got the mean all right then you can do the root okay So this is the root of the mean, okay? So we start here, then you use square root of this. Then you got 230, okay? Then you can start plot. Plot the root, okay? This is VRMS, okay? For the full cycle, okay? I put here, full cycle analysis plot to the time okay then you will get something like this so you can see that now it's plot the RMS okay but at the end it's not right okay but here you can see it goes staggered here because the uh, calculation of mean around here it gives you the effects like this okay so what should we do to solve this we are using half cycle mean now how do we do half cycle full cycle is 100 point half cycle is 50 point so we go to number 24 here okay and then you take the mean average okay now take from 0 up to 49 All right there and then press enter okay and then copy to the end okay or you can double click here and then check how the RMS looks like this is for half cycle square root of this okay 
So if I plot this, uh, okay, you can see that it's become smoother. Okay, so that's how we do uh, the RMS analysis. So for this, you can see that this waveform it goes up from two hundred thirty. Uh, and then it goes down to about 50 okay that has uh, 0 0.2 PU here okay so how do we get PU out of this okay you can take the PU for per unit you just take this RMS and then divide by the uh, nominal RMS okay and how does it look like there you can see it goes from 1.0 now it's become 0 0.2 in the middle okay so um, if you don't like the uh, something at the end and then the hollow in the middle, you can always uh, plot all this graph to start at uh, let's say twenty millisecond up to three hundred eighty. Okay, so that we get rid of the last, the first cycle and the last cycle. Okay, do it for all this okay okay that's all for this video I hope you know how to plot the RMS bye